Hey there, if you've ever been ready to check out on Popmart and then got hit with that unable to process your order. Please try again, or a stubborn 500 network error, you know how frustrating it can feel. You reload the page, you jump between Wi-Fi and mobile data, you clear your cache, but every time you hit proceed to pay you just end up staring at the same message. It's like being stuck in a loop when you've got your heart set on that new Labuba drop. A simple place to start is by giving your device a quick reset. Turn off your Wi-Fi, switch over to mobile data or vice versa, then close the Popmart app or browser tab completely and open it again. Sometimes that fresh connection is all you need. If you're on a browser, try switching from Chrome to Firefox or Edge. If you're on the app, make sure it's updated to the latest version, developers push fixes all the time, and an outdated app can stumble over busy servers. If the basic switch on, switch off routine doesn't clear the error, head into your device settings and clear the cache and cookies for the Popmart app or website. That often removes any corrupted files or leftover data that might be triggering the error. You can also try logging in on a different device or even in an incognito or private browsing window. That fresh session won't carry over any old data that could be causing the hiccup. Another trick is to check for any browser extensions or ad blockers you have running. Sometimes those tools can interfere with scripts on the checkout page and trigger the network error. Try disabling them temporarily and reload the page. If you still see the 500 code, it could be that the servers are overloaded. In that case, waiting 5 or 10 minutes and trying again can make all the difference once traffic eases up. If you've tried everything, network swaps, cache clears, browser changes and nothing works, it might be time to reach out to Popmart support with a screenshot of the error and details of what you've tried. While waiting, keep an eye on official Popmart social feeds or community groups for any announcements about server issues. With a few of these steps, you'll save yourself the endless refresh cycle and get back to snagging your favorite drops without that 500 error slowing you down.